Hi, beloved in the Lord. My name is Amy Lady. This is Heavenly Host Vision with Lady. I am so glad to welcome you to yet another prophetic word. May the Almighty God bless you and keep you safe, sound, and protected. The warlock that is sent to destroy you is seriously sick. News, beloved. The warlock that is sent to destroy you is sick. The tragic event that they planned over your life is over their head right now. Someone regrets taking a responsibility. Someone regrets following an instruction that was impossible. They thought that because they had known you, they had been with you, they figured you out, they will be able to penetrate you just like that. Just end up realizing that you are a no-go area. Just end up realizing that the God whom you serve is stronger. Just to realize that you are not playing with your God. Just to realize that the hand of God is over your life. And what they came towards you to perform is now speaking against them. Someone is seriously sick. Someone is, someone is at a hospital, beloved. Someone has been rushed with, to the hospital. All of a sudden, someone just fell. Someone or someone has been sick for a while, and they've been like questioning themselves why they've been sick. It's because what they intended for you backfired against them. All what they plotted against your life spiritually, invisibly fell back against them, but they were not aware. They thought that they had executed their plans. They thought that they would watch you suffer, what they did against you. Yet, you're not suffering. Yet, you're shining. Yet, you're doing God's work. Yet, you're just, you're, you're just the same and, and, and even like improving in most areas of your life, beloved. And someone is still at the same position, position where you left them, where they had been. They've even, they've even uh, you know, gone to the worst positions right now. Facing worse situations right now. As a result of what they targeted you with. They wanted to target you to, to, to fall into sickness. But they ended up getting they ended up in, in health situation, beloved. Proverbs 6, 26, verse 27. Whoever this a pit will fall into it, and a stone will roll back on him who starts it ruling. Or who, yeah, who starts it rolling? Glory to God. That's English standard version. Let's go to um, NIV. Whoever digs a pit will fall into it. If someone rules a stone, it will rule back on him. Hallelujah. They ruled a stone against you, but the stone ruled back against them. It backfired. Even with greater force. Because the stone met a resistance. The stone met with the power of God in your life. The stone met with grace. The stone met with Christ in your life. And all of a sudden, things just changed. Things transformed. So they started feeling weak. I started feeling, they started feeling, they started feeling dizzy. And then all of a sudden, they are all, they are, they are so sick right now, beloved. But they won't tell you what they did. What did they do? Someone did something that backfired. And they are suffering the consequences right now. But they won't tell you what they did. Someone needs to confess what they did. That landed them into a situation. Someone needs to confess. Someone is at the hospital right now. Or someone is at home, so sick. They need to confess what they did. That got them into a situation. God, the Lord shall continue to protect you. But I heard God saying clearly that the warlock, they sent a warlock against you. It's at night. They communicated with you. So to some, of, some of them, they, they communicated with you. And as they communicated with you, they transmitted a spirit. 
to some they actually saw you face to face and they were talking with you then they transmitted a spirit but the spirit didn't that spirit didn't penetrate you it went right back it went right back at them and now they can't reverse anything because they are already suffering it the spirit didn't penetrate you Therefore, it, it, it was supposed to have looked for somewhere else to go to. And it went back right at them. And because it could not receive back the spirit in a certain manner, it got into the man and started operating in them. Someone is operating under their own curse. Someone is operating under their own affliction that they targeted towards someone else. You are protected. In the name of our Lord and Savior Christ Jesus. Hallelujah.